Oh, after I adjust myself for 10 minutes and then look at myself in the viewfinder for another five, we can finally start the video. I was thinking about it and I was like, you know what? Like, I'm just gonna be honest with myself. I am a person that needs a lot of improvement. <laughs> And I'm a person that has a lot of flaws. This was actually Shane's idea that he gave to Ryland that I secondhand stole. I am the clumsy one in the family. I need a little bit of training. Um, we're going to be taking a dining etiquette class so we can learn how to eat like the Royale, the college frat boys that wear vineyard vines, you know, just like the high class individuals. I can't go out with some guy and have like taco sauce dripping down into my tits like so I just need to learn I'm accepting that I need to learn so <laughs> Why is everything so funny today? Or you guys know that I usually do like a sponsor a month on my channel to help you know live in my apartment. Today's sponsor for this video is going to be Honey. So Honey is a free tool that you can download to your computer's browsers and while you shop online, it will scan the internet for coupon codes and discounts and when you check out, it'll automatically apply the biggest discount that it can find online for you. Honey also works on over 20,000 websites including Ulta, Target, Sephora, Amazon. This literally takes zero effort to install. You just have two clicks. You can download Honey. It's already set and ready to go and you don't have to do anything. So I always use Honey when I'm shopping for house stuff. I was trying to find new bed sheets. I picked out some bougie sheets from JCPenney and without even having to do anything, I saved $34.35. Do you know how much you could do with $34.35? A lot. I'm gonna go to Chili's and like live. Honey actually has over 100,000 five-star reviews on the Google Chrome store. For the people that have already downloaded Honey and used my code, you guys have already saved an average of $57.79 on your average purchase, so that's super cool. You can get Honey for free at joinhoney.com slash Morgan. Um, and now we will get into the etiquette class. Thank you so much to Honey for sponsoring this video. They're a huge help to my channel and to the creation of my videos, so. Hey, okay, bye. As I'm sitting here, I can feel the big tail of my legs melting off. This is her. This is who we're meeting. What's her name? Like, let Lisa. me guess. Oh, I wanted to guess. <laughs> she looks very proud. Oh, she's gonna hate us. She's I gonna know. Who let these slobs into my sight? So, is this like expensive to learn how to have manners? Um, a hundred dollars each. It's an investment in, in your future. Yeah. <laughs> If we're gonna be boss babes, as everyone yeah. calls it. Girl bosses? Yeah, if we're gonna be girl we're bosses, bosses, we need to know how to be proper when we have to go to like fine dining meetings. Yeah, when we have all our top secret meetings that we can't tell you about for the next eight months, we're gonna have to be proper about it. So Morgan was like, is that Nick Jonas? <laughs> Where are you filming me? Oh, he's like, oh, what? What? And I was like, probably. And then I was like, no, that's just what everyone looks like in West Hollywood. Everyone's Nick Jonas here. The good thing is we're late to our etiquette class. <laughs> okay, yeah, we have one minute to spare. Skirt is on the shorter side, oh, sweetheart, so I'm going to tell you to really keep things. I have shorts um, on. Does that oh, count? Good. Right? Okay, so we've got uh, <laughs> some undergarments that are protecting. So Setting the tone. Wow. Wait, this is crazy. I love my manner. Well, boys, we're drinking tonight. <laughs> Who doesn't love drinking at 3 p.m.? We live in a very casual environment uh, in LA. So for entertaining, if you all ever entertain, I, when else are you going to display your nice dishes, right? <laughs> or assuming you have some real dishes, I, because so many people are very um, apt to take out paper plates, right? Yeah, we both ordered the same thing. I want this one because they boop, boop, more. We use paper <laughs> towel as, you know, instead of even paper napkins, even though I would advise cloth napkins. But when you're alone, you pull out a paper plate, huh? No, never, actually, <laughs> no. I, you saw a dinner at our house, you would faint. You'd have to oh, be drunk. Really? Like, extremely, yeah. Oh my goodness. It's, it's just about, again, thinking of another person right. and their needs before your own. And it doesn't have to be 
about gender. The only time anyone's ever pulled out a chair for me is when they've pulled it out from under me <laughs> and let me fall. Oh, nice. <laughs> to the ground. How nice so is that? Fun. I'm going to teach you the continental style of dining today, which is actually not American style. So we're, our hands will not be in our laps. They're actually going to be wrists above board, just like this, where everyone can Always. see. Always? Uh, sort of your default position. And this also helps with posture, which you both are actually sitting very nicely at the table. Oh my God. You're I'm really trying. Well, because you are. You're <laughs> making an effort. I can feel it. Oh, look. Oh. Are you helping us? It's Could me. you not corral yeah. somebody? I'll, I'm not going to drink because I'm teaching, but may I have a, an empty glass? We won't be opposed if you yeah. want to drink. Oh, no, I got to keep my game on. <laughs> I like this. It makes me feel like I'm at the White House. Right? And that's the thing. You never know when you'll be invited. We lean, we're going to lean in to eat our food versus sitting back and kind of shoveling it in and letting it all fall on our laps. We have, oh nice. Thank, Thank you. you so much. It True. looks like your wine is cold, which is a good thing. Thank you. My white so wine, I like cold. And I'm gonna let you drink that in a half of a millisecond. Let you drink that in a half of a millisecond as soon as I cover the napkin. So, but where do you wipe your mouth? You fold back the upper right corner. Right. So if this is on my left, and then you wrap a couple of fingers and you use this interior, right hand side, to kind of wipe. And then you return the napkin oh, to, your that is to your lap. You lost your strap, sweetheart. Ah! Where is, you need to How check, did that like, even happen? Can I, can I just, like, can I just do something how? here? Morgan, hold now this will not move. <laughs> did you not know that you can tighten these straps? Are both of your phones on vibrate? Yeah, right I now, get so? mad when people have loud phones. Okay. I mean, like, who needs to know when you're in a group setting that you're getting a text? Like, right. why do your friends need to know? You're not they gonna, don't. I mean, you want to be present for the people that you're actually in front of, right? It, you just, no one is that important. Right. Can we try right. it? Pinkies out. Oh please! And, and you can you can sort of you know give each other a little toast, mm -hmm. a salute, you know, to After good health or had... to family, to um, this beautiful day with the sun shining literally right on us. To here. our palace, mm -hmm. Jesus. Mm -hmm. Thank the you know universe, etc. Mm. That was a big sip. Was that a big? <laughs> was that was that a gulp? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, or she's, a twofer. She's gulping. You're probably not supposed to gulp at the table, right? I don't know. I just saw it looked like a nice, uh, a nice swallow. <laughs> now we have this yummy oh, bread. Oh my god! So the sign of a good restaurant, and we are very happy with Maggiano's no matter what because they gave us this beautiful room. Right. So, so plug to yes. Maggiano's. Here's what happens if you have a community. Oh, you know what we don't have anyone else joining <laughs> us <laughs> besides that okay wait i, I already dumped my spoon you don't oh, you uh, oh my gosh riley you. Oh, this looks the like table. a game of yes. sudoku okay. Okay. okay i'm failing why are you doing but why is okay, the clumsy one doing better hold than me hold on so have you heard of the car bmw yes, yes. okay so what work with me here okay. b is for bread m is for meal W is for water. I said I'll only date a guy with a BMW. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Now, rather though than, than serve myself first, because that would be just really rude, right? I want to open the basket and offer it to the person on my immediate left, which you happen to be in the better seat, and you'll just touch the one that you want, place it on your bread plate, perfect. It may take some butter. So pick up the entire plate, sweetheart. Use your knife. People do not know how to butter their bread the right way. People will take the roll, take the butter, and spread it across the entire piece and proceed to eat it. And what happens is, A, it can look like you're ready to shove something in your mouth and you can't wait, and B, you can get some butter on the corners very easily. Right. Twist to the left, break the bread over your plate. This is where you can get a pinky in there if you want to look daintier. Take a little butter, spread it on my bread. I like to clean my knife so that there is no residue. Bring the bread into my mouth. I okay. shoved a whole roll in my mouth in the fifth grade and I had to get the Heimlich from the Are lunch you lady. serious? She's, got, she's oh, also gone to the hospital for eating chips, so. <laughs> Wait, seriously? <laughs> eating a whole bag of chips, yeah. Uh -huh. When you eat soup, it's all about scooping away, not toward, right? Because eating minestrone soup, this is an orange colored soup, it's not gonna be a good look, right? right. Spoon, you don't have to, A, sh look like you're shoveling in <laughs> sand, right? So we start by scooping away and then drinking from the side of the bowl like this. 
<laughs> mm. I feel like the sound this is not cute. We say to fill up your spoon at a, a, maybe three quarters of the way, and don't be afraid if you need to kind of brush the side to get any of the um, the drippings to make sure they don't fall. Island's already going to be needing his second glass or third glass up? of wine. Uh, well, is there food still in there? A little bit, but you know when you okay, want to so get really in Okay, so you want to tilt it the there. other way, though. Uh, like, you're <laughs> tilting it away from you. And that's, that's what the bread is would, for. Exactly, so I spill on the haters, you, not myself. Yes, exactly, exactly. <laughs> She's gone to two hands now to steady the wine glass. The more wine I get, the worse this oh is going to be. God. So, okay, what if Unless I want to get the remnants? Is it okay if I just come oh, over here? Oh, no. <laughs> That's where the bread comes in handy, mister. Oh, okay, so then I tear Talk off my about piece. really looking like... Your uh, daughter will never date uh, him. That, yeah, well, that. I'm already engaged to a man, so they're fine. <laughs> okay. I feel like we have a very similar ring. Oh. Don't we? Same. That one right How here. How long have we been married? You ready? I'm gonna guess. Oh okay, yeah. You guess, you guess. 36 years. Okay, oh my wait, wait, wait. gosh. How old do I look? I think you're 47. <laughs> okay, that's a night. That's, I'll take it. I'll take that. We're not but guessing her age, we're but, saying how long oh, she's been married. Oh, what are we doing? Oh my gosh. <laughs> we're guessing how long she's been Thank married. Thank goodness, no. Ah! First of all, no matter how many knives or forks you have, you always work from the outside going in toward your plates. I think it's two utensils or no utensils, unless you're having soup. But forks and knives are a pair. They are married. Oh. Okay, so what are these for? Oh, I'm gonna guess. Mm -hmm. Entrees. No, Appetizers. not quite. So sides, mac and cheese. Okay, <laughs> like a side dish. I will if if mac and cheese had a certain ingredient, perhaps cheese crackers and cheese. No, although this could look like a cheese knife, right? But this is for fish. Do you do you like fish? Do you both eat? Oh, fish? I'd rather go to Wendy's. I, well, no, I like salmon. I do for, like salmon. So no fish for you. Oh, I'll eat fish. Oh, sure. Okay, fish. okay. So just not with the head, right? Or the eyes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Morgan, raise your left hand. Place the fork handle in the palm. Knife is going to go in the palm of your hand. So basically your index fingers will be extended here. Pierce the food with the fork and then cut it with your knife. Down. Whoa. Interesting. I'm well, like a scooper. So. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Whoa. That was a big bite. Okay. I will show you what I like to call a party in your mouth. Okay. Which is basically. <laughs> Every Tuesday night. We're really. <laughs> I don't even know what that means, but I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. So we really should have a green on here. Right. Like an actual vegetable. Should I march into diet. that kitchen? No, we're, we're not gonna bother them. All but right. cutting a piece of protein. And then if you wanna get a little potato. Right. They don't sell this at Party City. Mm hmm. Mm. Right? Well, Mm. Maggiano's mukbang is lit. Wait, it's what? <laughs> if you see the handle going up, like in this pitchfork oh. position, something is rotten in Denmark. Okay, so look at me. This, I go to restaurants and I see people eating like this. No, <laughs> I guess this pitchforking it. Yeah. The, the knife is totally on the wrong side of the fork. They I have really... no idea what they're doing and they're struggling to cut their meat. You I mean, just almost literally did... almost killed yourself. I know. Yourself. Can we not point that <laughs> knife at your neck, please? Plate and right. knives and forks must be held together, Missy. So when you're when when this is set, fate four times down, this hand is still holding the knife. Right. It's two utensils or no utensils. They did not teach me that at on the border. She Is worked a, on oh, the border. I worked to do mommy burger for a very long okay, time. Okay, but were those more casual eateries where Oh, do you think they were hiring us for fine dining? <laughs> this is a secret language. Right. This is the secret language to the wait staff that says, please do not take my food. I am resting. Right. You have this position. You come back. If it's gone, oh, you you're have killing. every right to say. <laughs> then you're pitchforking. Yeah, then you're, yeah, and you're saying, then you're uh, nice I need out. a whole new meal, please. I'm starting from the beginning. There I am go. ready to be invited to the Royals. <laughs> okay, exactly, right? I have to sneeze. Oh, do you? This napkin is a blast shield for all <laughs> germs, okay? Did I say that right? So keep this guy down and bring this into your mouth that way. But you've got this fold here. I'm worried things are gonna fall into that little oh ledge. God. She'd save it for later. <laughs> She'd find it in the Uber on the way home and just be like partying. 
everybody's got some type of crazy, right? Right. What's but it's, yours? Yeah. What's mine? <laughs> Are we yeah, seriously asking? Come on. No, I have, my, my daughters would tell me I'm totally off my rocker. I'm a stickler for certain things. All That's right. my type of crazy. My literal crazy is my driving. Ooh, oh, like you, you get mad at people, LA you're aggressive or what? I am a New Yorker. Okay. And I used to drive in New York. So I like to be the first in yeah. every line, Me on too. every street. And I'm like, let's get there the fastest way possible. Right. And if we don't, the world's over. Exactly. Yes. As if there's a fire that's chasing us on the road, right? <laughs> I'm saying. Yes, what about correct. you guys? What would you say your crazy is? What do you think I'm crazy about? Oh yeah, there you go. Mm. This is good. <laughs> I'm high maintenance, that's you... for sure. I get that. <laughs> No, no, I mean, I, I can I am, relate. I know, I, I am can relate. But I'm Jewish and high maintenance, so they call it high maintenance, <laughs> the C H A I. Anyway, go ahead. His thing is, after everyone's done eating, he like starts cleaning up before people are even done. The whole thing. Because okay. I'm the. I, I'm the cleaner of the house and it's always a disaster because everyone's always eating all the food but nobody has the urge to clean it up and I'm like, I'm not waking up to this mess so I'm over here like <laughs> Okay, okay, Can none of them are ever gonna clean and I go to bed okay. before everyone. They're all fine staying up till 1, 2, 3 a.m. Right. I'm like, 11.30, I gotta go to bed. Lights out. See okay. you guys. Well, why isn't everybody at least, at the very least, Bussing their own table. Exactly. Are you kidding me? Are you okay. kidding me? Her crazy as she can't plan to save her life. Yes, she goes out of town and I'm like, Morgan, when are you coming back? And she's like, I haven't booked a return flight. Oh, okay. She's I'm coming a free back spirit. I'm coming back Tuesday. And like, it's Wednesday, are you home? <laughs> oh, I think I'm gonna come home on Sunday. So oh. did you book a flight or not, right. Morgan? What the is going on? <laughs> you know? Whoa. All right, I need some more wine. <laughs> Napkin goes on the left side of your play setting, so to the left of the forks, mm. that's still you. And you <sighs> left as elegantly as you arrived. Versus, right. you know, people will throw it on top. Or they'll, worse, they'll put it in their plate. Have you seen people put their oh, napkin? Oh, yes, oh wait. I wrote a book called Beverly Hills Manor's Golden Rules from the World's Most Glamorous Zip Code. And since you two are based here, right? Yeah. You need this book, but it is a Bible for how this town works. Is it on Amazon? It is, t absolutely. And guess what? You can download it on Audible. Mm -hmm. I'd love to have anybody reach out and, and, yeah. and share the wisdom. Right, well, well, check out Lisa, check out her classes. Honestly, we learned a lot more than oh we Oh my gosh. So glad. And I thought it was gonna be like, books on our head, like. <laughs> oh, well, we could have been doing that. <laughs> No, they just yeah. went to the dining. Next time, yeah, me too. But well, we did want to know how to dine. How to walk in high heels. Oh yeah, I don't know that. I'm a professional. Okay. <laughs> to have this, these, I talk about the ima imaginary manners tool belt. Right. So I'm handing you guys the tools. And this is for you to break out right. as needed. And so now you've got these arsenals, these tools in your arsenal. Right. Maggiano's, thank you for the <laughs> lit room. Thank the you food for the was room. fabulous. Shout yeah, out to Lisa. Room. Shout out to Maggiano's. <laughs> exactly. Shout out to this cake. To the grow. The whole thing. The to grow. the grow. And to the gorgeous <laughs> California weather. Yeah, honestly, shout out to the world. Right. Hallelujah. <laughs>